Hello, hello, my lovelies. I'm so glad you're here. Welcome back if you have seen any of my other videos and welcome for the first time if this is the first time you found me. I am Bethany. I am a online reseller uh, who sells things on platforms such as Poshmark, Mercari, eBay, Facebook Marketplace, and more. Um, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. I am trying to build my community here and I would love for you to be a part of it. Uh, so just hit that subscribe button. Please uh, like this video, drop a comment, all that good stuff. <laughs> um, so today we are doing a haul video. Um, you can kind of see here. And side note, yes, those are Bluey stickers on the back of my couch. Um, my toddler made some uh, collage art and I don't want to take it down. <laughs> so uh, just ignore that part. Focus on this part over here. Um, so we're doing a haul video today. Um, a local thrift store um, had a $15 bag sale today. Um, so anything that you could fit into a bag um, for $15. Um, the, the thrift store itself is part of St. Vincent de Paul, uh, but it wasn't a, an actual like St. Vincent de Paul shop. It was like a private little shop that's like under the umbrella of that, if that makes sense. Um, so I had never been there before. I've, I've driven past it quite a few times and it was on my list of thrift stores to check out. Um, so when I saw on Facebook that they were having the bag sale, I thought, why not? <laughs> you know, might as well check something out. Um, you know, if I can just find... 15 items and that's a dollar an item. Um, so when I went, um, most of the stuff wasn't really, uh, you know, brands and styles that I would pick up, but I did manage to get enough for my money's worth. <laughs> um, so uh, technically there are two bags here, but um, the lady when she was checking me out said uh, she didn't want the shoes to poke a hole in the bag. And so uh, she was going to put it in two bags, but only charge me for one, which I was like, okay, thank you for that. <laughs> um, so with that being said, um, some of the stuff I got for reselling, there is some stuff in here too for, that I got for my kid, um, but you're going to see those too, because why not? <laughs> um, and then at the end, I'll do like a count of like how many items I got and like what the price per piece was then for it. Um, but yeah, it's like a full size, like garbage bag um full and hello Daphne we've got lots of new sniffs <laughs> to do so um let's dive in and take a look and see what I got Daphne's gonna be my handy helper here all right so first off uh we got a pair of Nike athletic shorts uh size small obviously yeah small there I actually got two pairs of Nikes this one is a medium here. I was going to say I could bundle them, but if they're two different sizes, then maybe not. <laughs> Next, I got this gorgeous vintage 100% wool dress. Um, all wool. Um, super cute little sheath dress. Um, they had a lot of vintage. A lot of this stuff was like kind of like grandma Core, but not like cute Depop grandma core, but like actual grandma stuff. So um, I passed on a lot of it, but I picked up a few things enough to get my money's worth. <laughs> um, next, I got this Michael Michael Kors dress. Uh, I don't know what size it is. Here, another little sheath dress, and it's got some like metallic things on it. What size is this? size has been cut off. Well, crap. <laughs> Let's see. Does it say down here? Maybe? My guess would be like, like an extra large, like a 16, maybe. I don't know. I'll, I'll look it up. Like sizing charts. Okay. Hello, Daphne. You're kind of in my way, honey. <laughs> uh, then we got some pink, what? Gold label, Victoria's Secret, sleep shorts. Kind of that like silky pink. It's not. It's not actually silk. It's just. It's polyester. Yeah, it's polyester. Um, but it's kind of like that satiny feel to it. And then um, American Eagle 
straight leg jeans, size four. Um, someone must have been a big fan of them, of the straight leg jeans in size four, because I think I picked up like four pairs of them. Uh, here's another one, straight leg, lighter wash, also size four. <laughs> and these are the artist crop American Eagle jeans. So slightly cropped, dark wash. Um, I tried not to get like skinny jeans too much because I feel like those are kind of fading out. Even though my millennial heart will not fully accept it, I will wear skinny jeans until the day I die. But, <laughs> um, <laughs> you know, it's, in terms of fashion, it's going out, I guess. Um, then another Michael Kors, must have been the same person because they also cut out the size tag there. Um, I'll have to look it up. But again, it kind of looks like a, says like 14, 16. Um, and it's like a, it's black and white, but it's like giraffe print, I guess. Sheath dress. Get that. So, oh, and it's got, I just show it to you backwards. No, pockets, okay. I don't know. I'm losing my mind. It's late at night tonight. Uh, it's been a long day. <laughs> we got another American Eagle straight leg jeans. Um, like I said, I got like four pairs of the straight legs, all size four. Um, so someone must have donated all their stuff. Um, but I'm trying to figure out like, should I bundle them? Like sell them like all together? Or should I sell them separately? Let me know. What would you do? Would you, put them, would you put them all together or would you sell them separately? Let me know in the comments. Or maybe do like two and two. Oh. Anyway, let me know in the comments. Please interact. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Next, I got, um, let's see, black. These are Brooks Brothers, Natalie Fit, black kind of dressy pants here. And then another pair of Brooks Brothers. These are 100% wool, just pants, size 14. Uh, the other pair was also size 14. So it was kind of nice. I, I was able to find um, some good like mid-size, uh, like mid-size slash plus size clothing. So um, that always does really well for me. So 100% wool, black dress pants by Brooks Brothers. Those were nice. Them. These are Lane Bryant um, black dress pants. These are a 22. Here. 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 Uh, it's got like the elastic waistband, which is always nice. So, <clears throat> got some good like workwear. Uh, it was a lot of, from what they had at least, it was a lot of um, kind of like workwear, formal wear. Um, and just kind of more, like I said, again, like things that like, my, like my grandma would want to wear, <laughs> um, a lot of like elastic waistband pants and like those like embroidered bedazzled t-shirts and things like that. Um, <laughs> so I did pass on a lot of it, but you know, I, I, I got some stuff, <laughs> um, another pair of the straight leg jeans, kind of like in a medium wash. I was able to get a dark wash, a light wash, and a medium wash of those. So that could be a good bundle. Let me know. What do you think? And another pair of straight leg, size four. And all of them are size four. <laughs> Let's see, what's next? Uh, these are Vince black pants, size six. Um, and it's a linen blend pant there, so very nice. Um, okay, so then I was able to get some stuff for my kid um, for summer. So a cute little t-shirt, some macarons, um, and that's Carter Carter's? No, Falls Creek. So was that Walmart? I don't care. 
<laughs> um, and then this one's crew cuts here. Little tank top with like a little bow. Um, so once you outgrows that one, then I can sell it. <laughs> um, Carter, yeah, Carter's cute little dress when it's really hot out. Um, a little romper here, also also Carter's. No, Jimbery. One's Jimbery. Um, crew cuts. Let's see. Yeah, another crew cuts t-shirt and it's like shimmery metallic on the front and like gray in the back um so again i can sell that <laughs> um i think these two might have actually like been sold together i don't know they're both crew cuts and i will probably bundle them when i do go to sell them just because it'll be easier um but this one's super cute little t-shirt and it's got like little tassels and pom-poms <laughs> Although knowing my kids, she will 100% try and like pull these off because she's a tiny tornado, but I love her. <laughs> um, and then a little pair of shorts that are Carter's. There. So, um, all right. So then for shoes, um, pretty much all clothing, shoes, accessories, all of that um, was all included within the bag sale. Um, so I got a pair of these Betsy Johnson, um, they're kind of like snakeskin peep toe shoes here. These are size eight. Um, so they're pretty good condition. There's a little bit of wear like on the heels. Um, but overall, I mean, they're good. Betsy Johnson shoes do pretty well for me. Um, her shoes and her purses, I feel like sell really well the dresses like dresses and clothing meh um but her accessories do really well for me um let's see next i got a pair of dansko little mary janes here um dansko is kind of known more for like their clogs that's kind of like their classic shoe but they do have other styles um and they're really comfortable um, they tend to have like good support, so people like wearing them. Um, and these are a size 10 here. So, and again, like there's a little bit of wear to them, but overall, like good condition. Let's see. What's next? Um, I got a pair of men's kind of boat shoes. These are Polo Ralph Lauren. Um, and these are, what size are you? These are a nine, men's nine. They look bigger than that, but I guess not. Okay, so good for summer. <laughs> if they were 11s, I'd probably make my husband wear them first. <laughs> then I got these suede, uh, brown suede Steve Madden boots. Um, yes, we are going into summer, but I pick up things year round um, and I list things year round because you never know where someone lives and you never know where they might be traveling to so they might need boots um, and I mean I've sold sweaters in July so <laughs> um, these are seven and a half and they've got like the little buckles and stuff so this is cute and then final piece that I picked up um, are these Sam Edelman, um, leopard print. The, it's got like, it's a type of fur. I don't know if it's man-made or real. Let's see, what does it say? Leather slash man-made upper, leather sock, balance man-made. So the fur is faux fur, um, but it's made to look like, like it's leopard skin or something. Um, it's got the buckle. And these are, size eight. So <clears throat> got those. So that is everything I got for $15, which I think is pretty good. Um, so let me tally it up and see how much, how many items I got. And then we'll do the math. I'll do the math. You don't have to do math. Don't worry. I'm not going to do that to you. <laughs> um, I will do the math and let you know how much everything is price per piece. So right now. <laughs> Hello. Welcome back. You didn't go anywhere. I just 
transitioned. Anyway, <laughs> so uh, I totaled it all up. Totaled it all up. It's late, y'all. Here, at least when I'm making this. Anyway, I uh, totaled it all up and I bought 28 pieces um, for $15, which is pretty good. So um, doing the math, that equals a about 54 cents a piece. Um, so in terms of cost of goods, that's great. Now that does include um, the items I got for my daughter, um, but I mean, I paid for it. So <laughs> that goes into it as well. Um, so for 54 cents a piece, I'm pretty sure I should be able to make a profit from it. Um, hopefully, fingers crossed. <laughs> um, <laughs> I should be able to get my $15 back. Um, so I can do a 90 day update, um, from when I get these listed. Um, so I'll try and get them, you know, listed at some point. Um, and then I'll do a 90 day update, um, after I get them all listed. I have quite a bit, um, in my death pile that I want to get listed first, but these will come. <laughs> um, so stay tuned for that. <clears throat> um, yeah, so let me know what was your favorite piece that I picked up? Um, have you ever been to a bag sale? What's like the lowest you've ever been able to get for cost of goods, not counting like free stuff. Um, and yeah, also if you want anything that I saw and you wanna grab it before it gets listed, um, my Instagram is down in the description. Send me a message on there. I will be happy to get that shipped out for you. Um, and like I said at the beginning, make sure you subscribe, make sure, give me a like, a comment, help me with the algorithm. Um, you know, I'd love to get a little more engagement on here. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, I keep saying every week I'm going to get better with my intros and outros and I am not. <laughs> so I think this is just what you're going to get, <laughs> but in the meantime, um, be sure to follow me on, on Instagram, um, interact, shop my closets. I ship next day. Um, those are all the links for those are all in my description as well. So, um, until next time, you're all lovely. You're great. You're fantastic. And we'll see you next week.